Hey Maximizers and welcome back to another day in the life. My name's Crystal and I've decided to do Vlogmas where I was going to post a video every single day and I think I got up to day 26 and then I was like y'all I'm exhausted. So I'm going to do a couple more vlogs for y'all. It is December 29th so I'm going to get this up as soon as possible. Today's an exciting day because we're going to see Avatar Way of Water at Disney Springs. So I'm about to get dressed now. So far all I've done is journal a little bit and I did a little bit of work as far as like cleaning out my emails and stuff so i'm about to take a shower listen to a podcast and then get dressed we're leaving in about an hour ish so it's time for us to start getting ready disney springs is a bop from our house our movie doesn't start until 2 15 but we want to get there early we have a little bit of shopping to do at disney springs so i wanted to bring you along i always listen to podcasts in the shower and i'm listening to dl sharon's black banked and booked out podcast and it is the miracle of making a million she's doing a series where every quarter she recorded her highs and lows of making a million dollars in 2022 so i'm listening to that as i shower so here I am getting ready after I got out the shower. I like watching this on other people's vlogs, so I thought I was included. My routine is I like to brush my teeth. I like to put in contacts if it's a contact day. And these are Hubble contacts. They're super duper soft, but sometimes they be itching my eyes. So you can see here, I'm going to squint a little bit. So if you're squeamish, don't watch this part. Because I was like, ooh, something's in my eye. <laughs> it took me a second. Then I like to put on my moisturizer. I just use... Um, first aid beauties moisturizer i freaking love it it is the best and then i do my hair okay so we are all dressed i put contacts in so that i can see the movie because we're seeing it in 3d here's kinsley yeah we're seeing it in 3d yes. here's kinsley so we're waiting for our day to finish getting dressed it's 11 40 so we are on track so now what i'm gonna do is we got a few dishes in the sink from last night so i'm gonna go ahead and wash these dishes up while we wait for Bay to finish getting ready tidy up a little bit and then we'll be on our way I'm not freaking out because like I said the movie's at 2 15 so I'm just giving us plenty of time to get there and parking if you've ever been to Disney Springs like I need to park in the orange garage but if the orange garage is closed then we have to park in lime or grapefruit or somewhere else this is giving us enough time to like walk and then you know, grab our movie snacks and everything. It's just giving us plenty of time. And we have about an hour ride. I used to live super duper close to Disney, but when I moved back, I moved further, further away from Disney. Oh my gosh. You did not need to put that on. This girl didn't put lip, her little, I bought her play makeup. She put lipstick on. Right. Imagine my outfits have red, green, and white. This girl. Pray for me. Okay, yeah. So about to just wash up some dishes and tidy up a little bit before we head out and we are going to dinner at texas roadhouse after so we're doing dinner in a movie okay so i'm super weird and we have a dishwasher but we don't use it to wash our dishes we use it to dry our dishes so i hand wash all of our dishes i honestly prefer it i don't know when i got like that i used to always use my dishwasher but then i was just like man it, it became like a habit because in Baltimore, we did not have a dishwasher. And then my sister's dishwasher was broke when we did have it. So I just got into the habit of hand washing dishes. So I make dishwater and I let the dishes soak and then I pile them up on one side. Then I rinse them all. And then after I rinse them, I go ahead and I put them in the dishwasher to dry. So in my house, the dishwasher is always clean because we never put dirty dishes in there. And then every so often I'll run, you know, a fresh hot rinse. So, you know, if there's anything, you know, how it can get nasty at the bottom from the drip, the dishes dripping. I rinse it and we have like dishwasher cleaner and we clean the dishwasher every so often. But this method works for us. Bay does all the cooking and it's my job to wash the dishes. So that's what I'm doing. And I'm trying to make sure that I wash them more often, even if I have to do it twice a day so that they don't pile up. Because we are known to let them pile up low key. But I'm like, you know what? Let's start better habits and i will wash them at least once a once a day but then they always pile up so i was like you know what f it we're gonna have to do it twice a day so this is just me putting them inside the dishwasher and i prefer this method let me know in the comments are you a dishwasher or do you wash your hands by wash your dishes by hand or you put them in a dishwasher let me know in the comments all right we've made it to disney springs we are My off. it's actually 116 so my cousin wants me to get a picture frame for her so we have basically about an yes 
we basically have an hour to kill while we wait for our movie because the movie's at 2 15 um so we want to be in our seats by 2 20 simply because oh hurry up simply because they're gonna do 20 minutes of previews so we'll get our snacks and stuff we'll walk to the disney store real quick get the picture frame and come back or do you want to do the picture frame after it's up to you do you want to do it after well, i don't know we'll figure it out I forgot we were like two, three days away from a holiday. It was packed like sardines. But we ended up going to the M&M store. Kinsley saw all the picture, like the things set up to take pictures. So we took lots of pictures. She saw the fountain. Mommy, can I touch the fountain? So of course she had to run up and touch the water. I'm telling her, Kinsley, please don't fall in uh, into the fountain. It clearly says, none. no, don't get in the fountain. They have little stages up for events. They always have like live music and stuff. And with new year's coming i know it's probably going to be packed here on new year's i was joking like sugar vibe is here kinsley found the disney 50th and wanted to take a picture in front of it and then like i said we made our way to the m m store that's where we're walking to now i just wanted y'all to see how freaking crowded it was and then we got to the m m store which was amazing we were just here like a month ago with my sister not even a month a few weeks so me and Kinsley decided to go and get m ms they did not want any but me and Kinsley made sure to fill up our bags and we each got like a pound of candy which was insane but let me know if you've been to the m m store because it's pretty epic and i'm literally directing bay and telling him try to, how to get angles he kept holding the camera vertically i'm like hold it horizontally this is for youtube he you know he gets it sometimes i'm like we're not doing tiktok we're doing youtube anyways he's showing y'all the back of my neck my neck so you can see my beady beads and i need to redo my braids which will happen in due time but me and kinsley had a great time All of our snacks. The movie was great. Did you like the movie? Okay, so now we're going to the World of Disney store to get that picture frame because we didn't do it before. We went to the M&M store instead. Look, baby, a cigar shop. So, yeah, now we're gonna go pick out a picture frame for my cousin and then we're gonna go to, yeah, and then we're gonna go to Texas Roadhouse. We don't have a time of our Y'all, Disney out here putting out the fake snow. It was kind of treacherous. It was getting in my eyes because, you know, I had my contacts on. It was crazy. But Disney property is so beautiful at nighttime. They had all these beautiful Christmas trees. I just had to show y'all. And then we got in the car and we headed to Texas so, Roadhouse. We made it to Texas Roadhouse. But me and Kinsley are taking a little bit of a walk. There's a one hour wait, but we did the wait list. So now we're taking a walk. And we're just walking, walking. We about to walk back. Let's go down here and walk back. So we're just walking. I'm surprised because I used to work over here in this area. I used to work in this area. I quit that job in 2015 and I worked there for from 2012 to 2015 and I quit in 2015 and then my office job when I worked at the timeshare the timeshare was down here so I still worked down this area until we moved call centers in 20 2017 is when we moved call centers 2017 2018 can't remember we moved call centers so I still was working down in this area. So just to see, since I stopped coming to this area every day, which was probably 2017, if I can get it straight. In 2017, we stopped coming down here all the time. It has built up so much. It's so crazy when you remember something being dirt and now it's like buildings and hotels and restaurants. It's just insane. And this Margaritaville Resort is absolutely insane. So if you know where that is in Central Florida, they probably don't work. Yeah, little dino steak bites. Mango margarita. They didn't put it in there for you. That's beige drink. Kenza got her little steak bites. All right, maximizers. It's the next day. And I just realized I did not record the ending as I was editing this video. I did not record the wrap up. But I was drunk. I had that big old margarita. So we came home after Texas Roadhouse and we watched like one episode of Chicago Med. 
then I crashed. But the day was awesome. Avatar was great. It was three hours and 15 minutes. We went into that theater around like 10 minutes to two and we left at 5.55. So we were literally in there for like four hours. We spent a ridiculous amount of money on snacks, but we don't go to the movies that often. So I had bought Kinsley and I some candy, but we did get popcorn and we did get ices. I got mozzarella sticks. Bay got a hot dog. So we spent like $60 on movie snacks, but we probably are going to go to the movies four, maybe five times a year. So I'm like, you know what? It's all right for us to splurge and enjoy ourselves at the movies because we're only going to go a few times a year. We're not the every month kind of people, but there's a couple more movies coming out that we definitely want to see. So Avatar was great. Texas Roadhouse was awesome. So let me know in the comments if you have seen Avatar and what you thought about it. I hope you enjoyed this day of Vlogmas and I will see you in the next video.